Barno, how's it going? Sorry to keep you all waiting. Wait, is my mic going? Is my mic going? Hopefully it is. Kia ora. Welcome. We are online. We are back. This is season two, episode one. Ask you live. Good to see you all, man. Hey, hoping you all do well, man. Doing well over lockdown time. And we're at the halfway mark now, Farno. Um, fingers crossed. Uh, we come out of it, you know, in the next couple of weeks. Um, Kia ora, Farno. How's it going? Oh, sorry. My bad. Just checking the stream on this side. Didn't turn down the volume here. Anyway, anyway. Hoping you're all doing well over this time. Man, it's just good to be back online. Um, hopefully doing some stuff um, over the next. We've got a few sessions planned or a few workshops or whatever we want to call these um, planned for the next couple of weeks. Um, and yeah, each week we're going to be live um, like uh, Thursday, Friday. We're just going to be on for this Thursday, but next week will be Thursday, Friday and potentially some Mondays. So I'm looking forward to coming through, sharing, getting back to what we used to do. Um, I really love this stuff and I love, really love sharing with people. Um, so I guess in saying that, man, one cool thing um, that's happening with us at the moment is, um, man, we've actually got some of us working in the Ask You Fano now. Um, we've got the bro Quinn, who's going to be helping um, run some of these live streams, hopefully make it some really cool like um, uh, content online, some tutorials and whatnot. And um, just want to bring that guy in um, to the chat right now. Uh, where are we, Quinn? Where are we? Boom. Oh, no, that is the wrong... There we go, there we go. Hit the... Uh... What up, Fano? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Test, test. Hopefully. Hopefully it's coming through, man. Yeah, cool. Um, Hold on, let me just... Well, up. my name's Quinton. Uh, I work for AskQ now. Uh, yeah, I'll be doing some online tutorials, doing graphic design, and hopefully some more other content as well that'll help you through this uh, quarantine time. And yeah, hey, bro, I didn't, I didn't <laughs> pull up on my tea, bro. What a rugged guy! <laughs> oh, what the heck, man? Far up. come on, cute, come on. Oh, I'll just say, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll just zip this up. It's black and white, so you know, sort of, you know, on brand, on brand. Oh, 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 yes. Gotta, gotta support the brand. <laughs> cool, man. That's nah, sweet, man. But hey, man, what we might do is, um, is anyone online? Oh, bro, we're just talking to ourselves, Quinn. <laughs> oh, shit, <laughs> man. Hey, it's all good, man, it's all good. Hey, you're going to be watching this afterwards anyway. Hopefully you find oh. this super valuable. But um, yeah, man, what we might do is we're just going to get straight into it. What we're going to be looking at today is, um, I guess, just two simple ways um, that you can connect and help remotely support uh, another person at their computer could be auntie could be uncle could be nan could be granddad um, whoever needs help um, you can be that tech superman super whiz whatever you want to call it um, and it's super super easy cool as so what we're going to do man first is um just going to jump over to my screen um, and we're going to show you the first way we can do this so hopefully i don't get um mixed up hopefully that is my screen right there yep there we go there we go hopefully hopefully that's all working i think it is i think it is i'm gonna roll with it anyway cool so um the first way we're gonna do it is we're gonna use um man super simple if you've got a gmail account we can use google hangouts google hangouts is a pretty much like zoom everyone's probably on the zooms teams skypes um, Google Hangouts is just a nice easy one and it's all within the browser as well. So I'm just going to crack on and open up. This is my Gmail account right now. Um, on the side here is where we can sort of bring people into our chat. But I've already got Quinn there. Um, and then once I click on him, it opens up this little chat window here to the side. Um, in here you can say, what up? Oh, wrong way. What? up boom flick him a quick message but the cool thing about this is just up the top here is i can call him in a video call so to remotely support him here we're going to video call in and then we're going to get him to share his screen to us so i'm um, just going to hit the video call button oh what up quinn what up boom and then 
just we're just calling him right now hopefully he's gonna pick up you're gonna you're gonna pick up quinn you're gonna pick up mate oh 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 <laughs> sorry bro i'll call you instead because my hangout is not working <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I'll, I'll close mine. I'll, I'll hang it up on the side. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Come on, Quinn. Bro, I thought we tested this, mate. I thought we tested this. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> there we go. Okay. okay, cool, bro. Call on in. Call on in, bro. Is that is that you? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. Cool, cool, cool. Gonna, gonna answer. Sweet. So, <laughs> so we're on now? We're on? Yeah, we are, we are. Yeah. All good, all good. So right now, Farno, um, because me and Quinn are using uh, our video in something else, um, uh, in our streaming, we can't use our video right here, but in general, what would happen is um, Quinn's video would be in the center area here, and uh, my video would show up on the bottom right-hand corner. Um, once we've sort of connected on this Hangout call, I'm going to go up to the top right-hand corner, got the three dots here, click that, and then we're going to hit share screen, but I'm not going to share my screen to him. Uh, we're going to get Quinn to share his screen with me. So I'm going to talk him through. Quinn, bro, on the top right of your window, um, can you click the three dots for me? Yep. Cool. And then I'm going to get you to click on screen share. And then hopefully, hopefully his screen is going to come through to us. Boom cool so that's that's quinn's screen right there um it's not my screen um quinn do you want to maybe open up your photoshop there mate maybe i'm maybe i'm you know he's he's hitting me up for some photoshop help quinn yeah yeah and um so this is all live this isn't pre-recorded Farno. um so i find that google hangouts is a nice simple way um to remotely connect to someone and see their computer on their side um, the only thing um can't do here, I think you can do it in another way of doing Hangouts, but I can't remotely control. But the fact that I can see him and talk him through stuff um, is super, super easy. So that's, um yeah, man, that's 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 step one, man. Easy as, or the, uh, the first way that we can connect and help someone remotely. Too easy, eh? Too easy, Quinn. Shot. Yeah, so, man. Yeah, yeah, pretty easy. <laughs> Hope you guys like my uh, project, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sweet, man. Now that's cool. Well, let's quickly jump over and we'll look at um the second way, Quinn. All good. Yep. Sweet, sweet. So I'm um, gonna hang up this call now. Thanks for sharing. Hopefully, I've helped you, Quinn. <laughs> Shop, bro. Thank you. Shop, man. But I'm um, gonna hang this call up now. Cool. Okay. I'm just gonna minimize this window here. Um, so the second way is, um, fingers crossed, super simple again. How this works is um, I need to install a bit of software on my side, and then we're going to talk to Quinn and talk him through installing and running some software on his side. So um, to do the step, you might need to be on the old you know, mobile phone, call up that Farno member, and then talk them through some instructions. But the um, app that we're using is um, TeamViewer. So it's a free app for non-commercial purposes um so you're free to download this is the this is it here um just google it up find the download button click download brings you over here and the one that you want um as the person that's going to be helping someone is right at the top here team viewer for windows okay just hit the download i'm not going to go through installing it or anything on my side um because i've already got it installed um, but I'm going to just, so I'm just going to minimize this. Um, but once it's installed, what you then want to do, I'm just going to open up, you're going to notice a black box coming up on my screen, Farno. Cool. Um, and then I'm going to open up TeamViewer. So I've already got this here. Now, that black box, the reason why I've covered it is because um, that's where uh, it has some details to allow people to remotely connect to my computer and control it. So I thought it was probably best for this live stream to block that up. Um, but essentially, once you've installed the app, this is what it looks like. And then um, essentially, on this side here, on the right-hand side here, this is where we input details to connect to the person that we're helping. Cool, Les. So um, I think your screen is shared out, Quinn. 
Hey. Yep. Cool, cool, Still cool. Still sharing out. Still sharing out. What we're going to do is we're going to jump over to Quinn and I'm going to talk him through the steps that he needs to take um, to be able uh, for me to be able to help him remotely. Cool. So, Quinn, we are now on your... Hopefully this is the right sort of screen. Oh, yeah, cool, cool, cool. Awesome. Don't worry about the black box, Farnet. Oh, no, I better turn that off for a sec. Hold up. Cool. So we're on his computer now, um, and I'm going to talk him through the steps that he needs to take. So Quinn, brother, man. Yes, bro. Can Sorry, I'm pretty yes, lost bro. on doing Sorry, this. I'm pretty lost on doing this. <laughs> no, no, August, bro, August. We got you, bro. We got you, man. You me, know? me. We got you. Me, so, me. Bro, um, what I want you to do is just, just open up Google Chrome, man. nice easy as easy as cool and then then what i want you to do bro is we're going to google team viewer quick support easy as and then um which one is it let's go i think it's probably that second one down will do bro that second link down yep all good let's click on that i think it's going to take us to the page that i've just shared with everyone which was the um yeah, the download page. And then what we want to do, Quinn, is we want to scroll down. And because we don't want to download this one on your side, we want Team Viewer Quick Support. That one right there. So we're not going to get Quinn to download this, Farno. But essentially, because <laughs> he's already downloaded, you know, we were prepared for this, Farno. Believe it or not, even though we've had a few mistakes, we were prepared. But um, essentially, what we want Quinn to do is hit Download Quick Support. It'll download a file into his downloads folder and then we're going to get him to run it so bro can you minimize that bro uh minimize that window there cool and then pull up your downloads folder cool and then yep uh we're going to get him to run that so i'm just gonna run that my man sweet sweet and it may take a little bit to to load up Farno. Oh, Quinn, I thought you had a fast computer. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, nah, cool, man. So, we've got another black box there, Farno. Essentially, I'm just blocking out um, a password needed to access his computer. But essentially, what's going to show up there is a user ID and a password. Um, so, I might just actually quickly jump back on my computer for a sec and just show you the steps that we need to take we're not going to connect to him because it actually like um we have some audio issues so i'm not going to do that but um you, you should be able to gauge the steps needed to be taken to be able to connect to him so i'm just going to flick back to my computer now boom so what you do is you you say oh man can you hook me up with your with your partner id please cool and then it's da -da 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 -da. yeah and then he hands it over i think that's bro is your partner id 161-649-0942 yep all oh, right yeah, cool sweet so we put that in there and then we want to ensure that the remote control option is selected here we don't want to file transfer we just want to remotely control and then we're going to hit connect and then what should happen um is this should pop up and it's essentially where we put in the password so um we're not going to do that though oh hold on it's a bit um oh i'm blocking it out hold on just move it over there there we go Farno. sorry wasn't looking down there but um yeah essentially we grab that password off and put it in once i hit login um this entire window here is going to change up and um we'll be able to see quinn's computer and yeah straight away you'll get um remote access to be able to control his mouse, open his windows, write something funny in his Word doc if we wanted to. Whatever you want to do, Farno. But in saying this, you know, be nice if you're going to do this. Don't be too silly. Um, don't wreck their computer of all things in the world. And I would say um, if if you are using this, um, uh, this bit of software, don't give out these details to just anyone because potentially they have the ability to remotely connect to you and just completely sass up your computer Farno. so um be safe out there and use it um very wisely but um yeah man that's sort of what we wanted to go through today Farno. i'm just gonna flick it back to where are we i think it's this one boom flick it back to the screen here just me and quinn um 
nah, super simple. I mean, these are only two ways to be able to do this. Um, essentially, you can do the same thing with Skype. Um, me and Quinn, Quinn, we've been on a Skype hard lately. Um, man, just screen sharing and doing a lot of remote work. So Skype is really cool and it's a solid connection. Um, if you use Microsoft Teams, you can use that uh, screen share and that option too. I think Microsoft Teams also gives you the ability to um, remotely control. Um, there's also Zoom, which is really, everyone's using that right now. Um, and there's probably a few more, but um, the main ones for me that I use is just Google Hangouts and TeamViewer. Um, super, super easy to get going up and quickly and um, really, really helpful. But um, man, I think that's it. Eh? Man, that's what we wanted to do finally, just jump back online, get back in the mix, get live. I guess following this show, um, me and Quinn have been talking a lot, eh, Quinn, about our um, our upcoming show. So, Quinn, bro, bro, what can you share with us? Can you share with us <laughs> <laughs> what what you're thinking in regards to potential future um, online workshops, my man? Oh well, uh, the first project I'll probably like to show everyone is how to um, modify a car to lower it down and also change it the color. Pimping. Pretty simple. Pimping yeah. is right. Nice. What else are you thinking, bro? Um, also, um, showing the glitch effect and also putting an image in the text. Sounds maybe hard for people to imagine that. Oh, <laughs> my, my, my bad, my bad. Um, text inside. Oh, oh, image. Uh, image so, inside. Uh, text. Image. <laughs> uh, what I mean by image in the text is um, uh, how would you explain it? Um, bro, do, so do you, you want to show bold... them? Do you just want to show uh, them? Yeah, I'll right, show yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'll oh, pull it up, bro. I'll let you get ready. So Quinn is really good at um, he's pretty good at Photoshop and um other Adobe Creative apps. So, gonna be looking to the bro there to be able to um come and share some of that good stuff with you all. Um, you all good? You want me to flick over to you, bro? Yo, yo, cool, cool. Hold up, I might need to. Oh, let me just get rid of that. Cool. You you're on, brother. You're on. Got a project, so good enough. Uh, uh, images, pictures, images, pictures. It's good. Oh, are you gonna go. do it, bro? Oh, Ben. Oh, just show them the yeah, honest ones, bro. Yeah. To give it oh, away don't, now. To oh, give don't. it away <laughs> now. No. <laughs> no. Um, all good. Um. Yeah. Sorry, I don't have. Yeah, a sorry, I don't have text. a image in the text. Oh, okay. Maybe show them the other one that you're um thinking of doing. Oh yes, the lawyer. Oh yes, the lawyer. Yeah. Just pull up the picture quick, bro. Just hard and fast. Sorry, 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 we we'll just jump back to the conference room. Nah, all good, Fano. We will, maybe, maybe. Um, what we can do is later on today, we'll find the photos of the potential images, um, and then upload them to our Facebook page so you can see it. Is that all good, Quinn? We'll do it like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounds yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Putting you on the spot, brother. <laughs> yeah, that's how Q likes to do it. Just chuck me in the deep end for a stream, eh? For our crack up. Oh, can't really hear you. Hey, what's up, Taylor? Sorry, I just saw saw a quick little message. He couldn't even hear us. We've probably been talking to ourselves. Oh, hey. It's weird. We just tested it. Um, man, we might have to go back and have a quick little watch. Um, but yeah, man, what we might do, Quinn, is we might wrap it up here, eh? Cool, cool. Damn, we did... We thought we had it all covered, Fano. We might have to go back to the uh, shed and test us all again. Bit of a bugger, but um, nah, hey, thanks for joining us. Um, thanks for joining us here. Keep a lookout for future ones. Again, we're going to be on Thursday, Fridays, and potentially Mondays. But um, if you have any ideas for any other upcoming workshops or things you'd like to see online, flick us a message, drop it in the comments, however you want to do it. Um, we're really, really keen to um, share with you on the next one. But um, Quinn, is that us? Yo. Sweet as Fano. Hey, have a
have a great day stay safe and um see you on the next one see you on